So you're going to do the third person singular of these vowels. Mm -hmm. Off you go. Yeah. Two calls back. You want ah, he calls back. Yes. He calls off. Oh, he calls off. To text, texting. He checks in. He cause, checks in. Because the, the yes. infinitive is never in the, yes. with an S. He checks in. He checks out. He chips. He pitches in. He pitches in. He canes across. He comes across. He comes across. He counts on it. He can He can uh, He counts on. He counts on us. He counts he, on. He counts on. He counts on. It's not he counts on. Yeah. He counts on. He counts on. He counts on. He counts on. Mm. He counts on. He counts on. He counts on. He counts on. Okay. okay. Let me explain. Mm -hmm. so, so the sounds a strong one is in the counts and then it's like very sharp on. Yes, yes. I think in the phrasal mm -hmm. verb that we're putting the stress on mm -hmm. the phrasal verb and not the preposition second bit. Mm -hmm. So he walks in, he counts on. The stress is going on the verb bit of the phrasal verb, not on the auxiliary, sorry, not on the preposition which f forms part of that phrasal verb. Okay? Mm -hmm. He goes up. If you said he goes up, mm -hmm. what, what's that mean? He goes up. Uh, means that he's going up. <laughs> he, he goes up means yeah. he's going up. He goes up means he's not going down. Do you understand that? You see the difference? Because mm -hmm. you're putting a stress. Mm -hmm. Okay, because normally the stress would be here. Uh, okay. On the first one. If you put it on the second, that is because you are saying something specific. You're putting a sentence stress. Okay. Okay, okay. carry on. Where are we now? Ah, he cuts back on. Mm -hmm. He cuts in. He cuts in. Without stress, just normal. He cuts in. He cuts in. He, he cuts, cuts in. He cuts in. No, you're giving me too much on the preposition. You're saying he cuts in. And I'm saying he cuts in. He cuts, he cuts in. That's it. Duh, duh. Yeah. Like when you're in the car and you accelerate and you go... Mm -hmm. He does over. He does. He does away with. Okay. Yeah. Because here, I thought we were just going to do an exercise mm -hmm. with the pronunciation of the s endings. But clearly, we also need to think about the where the where the stress is, mm -hmm. and then also we can play with that and do a sentence stress. Mm -hmm. He drop. He drops off. He drops off. He drops off. He no. drops off. That's it. Yeah. I hadn't anticipated this problem. Yeah. He is, he drops by. He is stop by. He stops by. Okay. He he ends up. Ends up. Ends up. He figured out, figured, figured out. Again. Figured out, figures he, out. That's it. You are missing it completely. Yeah. Figures out. Figures out. Figures out. Figures out. Also, what am I doing mm -hmm. between here and here? Uh, the liaison. Yes. Why? Because it's that the main vowel. And main the vowel. other one ends in? In consonant. Correct. That is the main use of the liaison. The second one is when it begins in the second word begins in a vowel and the first one ends in a consonant. That's one, and the other one is is in another vowel. Correct. So you have the two. Mm -hmm. Repeat that. Yeah, I know. When it's starting with a, a vowel, 
and the other finishing a consonant, or there are two vowels in different words. Yeah, you you can say, I know this shit, but if I keep making you repeat, and you're able to tell me quickly, because it's right at the front of your head, you Mm -hmm. see what I mean? Whereas if you know it, but it's kind of at the back of your head, like in the back of your cupboard or the bottom of your bag, you know what I mean? You have to reach for it, whereas if it's always here, and you're always telling me... Mm -hmm. Okay, carry on. To figure out. He figures out. He figures out. Figures out. Figures out. He fills out. Again? Fills out. What are you doing? Yes, um. And w- S or Z? Z. Fills out. Fills out. You're saying an S. Fills out. Okay, when you listen back to this, I want you to listen. Was I doing S or was I doing Z? Okay, okay. he fills out. He fills out. Fills out. Fills out. That's it. Imagine a Z. Fills out. Fills out. Imagine. He fills out. 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 You're saying an S. He fills out. Give me ten. Go. Push. Fills out. No, you're saying S. Okay, I want you to be able to do ten with no mistakes. Fills out. Fills out. Fills out. Fills out. Fills out. Fills out. Okay, you got it. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. we want it every time. Not yeah. just sometimes, other times. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, imagine like that, no? With a Z and with the two, with the two words together. Mm-hmm. Yes. Because if you start to see this, mm-hmm. what happens in your Spanish brain? Mm-hmm. You see an S. Yes. Then you start to get infected by the Spanish S. Okay. Mm-hmm. Carry on. Okay. Um. To find out. He finds out. Finds out. Finds out. He gets back. He gets back at. Yes. And then you did it nicely because gets back and you back out. Yeah. Yes, back out. Yeah. He gets in. Correct, but you didn't do the liaison. He gets in. He gets in. He gets in. He gets in. He gets over. No liaison. He gets over. He gets over. He gets over. You're doing too much stress on the last part of over. He gets over. He gets over. Because mm-hmm. the first one has the stress. Mm-hmm. There has to be a stress somewhere, no? Mm-hmm. It's on the first one. Has to be. Why? Mm-hmm. Because the, the second one is? It's a, it's a soir. Exactly. So the first one is like, mm. imagine one and a half, and the second one? Mm. Half. Half, correct. He, he gets over. Yeah, because otherwise we don't want to understand. Yeah. He gets together. Yes. He gets up. He gives... He gives he gets in. He gets up. Gives up. He gets up. Gives up. Gives up. He goes after. Goes after. Goes after. He goes against. Goes against. He goes against. Mozart. Yeah. He goes against. He goes against. He goes against. He goes over. More Z. He goes over. And again, you're putting too much stress on the second syllable. He goes over. He hands in. He hands out. More Z. He hands out. Together. He hands out. Hands out. Hands out. Because yeah. Hands out. I want you to get that. 
the right termination mm -hmm. and a full liaison and no extra stress on the schwa things. Okay, okay. next one. He hands on. He holds on. Holds on. Holds on. More Z. Holds on. Holds on. You're either doing a Z, mm -hmm. but cutting your chunk. Yeah. Or you're doing an S and flying them together. Holds, holds on. on. Holds on. Holds on. Holds on. Okay, well, you just slow down. Mm -hmm. And I want you to get the S or Z and the liaison, because these mm -hmm. are all liaisons almost. Yeah. Gips up. Let down, let down. Let's in. Cut your chunk. Let's in. Yeah. We, we're we doing a liaison here because of the vowel and the consonant, but also mm -hmm. why else? Because it's in the same chunk, because it's the verb chunk. Mm -hmm. If we cut our verb chunk, mm -hmm. and I am listening, and I have to understand this stuff, it's impossible because mm -hmm. if you start to cut where you don't want to cut, oh, and I have to listen to it for a long time. He looks over. He looks over. You cut your chunk. He looks, he looks over. And you're doing too much stress on your er. Uh. He looks over. He looks over. That's it. He looks forward. He looks forward. He looks into. He looks into. He looks into. He looks into it. Smoother. He looks into. He looks into. Together, he looks into. He looks into. That's it. He looks out for. He looks out for. It. He looks up to. He looks up to. To make up to. To make up to. He makes up to him. He makes up to him. He mixes. He mixes up. 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 Splitting your chunk still. Right. You need some more of the but the what the the the. the <laughs> okay, what we're going to do is you're going to uh, open either you can choose either something from your computer that you want to look at, mm -hmm. or review, or the newspaper. Which would you prefer? Uh, 